Here we will learn true facts about sloths. The three-toed sloth is different from the two-toed sloth in that it has one more finger. Yes, that's confusing. Regardless, if you're named after the number of toes or fingers that you have, you know you haven't done all that much to stand out. The sloth has razor-sharp claws on its fingers, and it would be the world's most deadly predator. But only if the world slowed way the f*** down. As it is, the sloth mainly eats leaves, because they tend not to run away. The only drawback being, they taste like leaves. On average, the sloth can move around three feet per minute, which is an impressive three feet per minute faster than a dead sloth. The sloth spends most of its time in the trees, although it will climb down once every seven days to urinate and defecate. To the insects living below, this is the worst day of the week. Like a tiny insect Armageddon with a flood consisting of seven days of sloth urine. Most likely the sloth does not urinate while it's in the tree because it's hanging upside down. Think about it. That would be messy. Now stop thinking about it. Why are you still thinking about it? Seriously. You're disgusting. Some sloths appear green because they have algae growing on their fur, which provides them with camouflage. Which is the same excuse I would give if I moved so slow that algae grew on me. It's camouflage, motherfucker. Mind your own business. The sloth is a relative of the anteater and the aardvark. Science isn't sure how they became relatives, but they're sure that it involved a kinky night with an elephant and a rattlesnake. If you're having a stressed out day, remember the sloth. They don't do shit and they haven't gone extinct. I'm sure you can afford to take a nap. Just don't pee if you're lying on your back. I know you were still thinking about it. Why is this sloth crossing the road? This is going to be a very, very long joke. <laughs>